Hello, this is Railrider. It has been a horrible year. You've been wearing masks and staying at home and washing your hands. Something had to be mass-produced to help you get through this horrible time. But they had to do tests, and they had to make tons of it. In order for you to get it. I am, of course, talking about the Lionel Vision Line at GS Northerns. I mean, seriously, have you read the title? What did you think I was talking about? This will help you get through the pandemic by giving you something fun to play with. It's time for... Mother f***ing Vision Line. Lionel decided to make tons of different versions of this engine. Still haven't made every single version of this engine. It's at least impressive that they did make many versions, though. Lionel's made the unstreamlined brass versions. Two versions where you won't know the difference. The Excursion Star! The one that comes with freight cars! The GS5s! The one that's also available in Western Pacific! And a few what-ifs, such as the Chessie Steam Special, really? Okay, I'm okay with Lionel making a chassis system version, but what ticks me off is the fact they, that they forgot the T1s. This one, of course. Seriously, Lionel has offered the Reading T1s in this catalog, and they forgot the chassis system. I mean, come on! The Jesse System T1 had classification lights! And this version, if it has classification lights, it will have the changing color ones! Lionel just lost a chance to make a Jesse T1 with two color classification lights! Why did they decide not to make the Jesse T1? Why? Oh, two new features that Lionel decided to put in every legacy engine from now on. Changing color lights and five different whistles. Well, since this one has both horn and whistle, it's gonna have two different horns and three different whistles. I thought it was just the Vision Line GS Northerns, but nope. It's gonna be every Lionel Legacy engine from now on. To change the whistle, just press AUX1 on the Legacy remote. Then activate the whistle. To change the rear classification lights from white to red, well, there's a little on and off button right here. Just push the on button, again and again. The front classification lights from green to white, well, you have to hold down aux 2 to get the button to show up, which will be right here. Then press on, again and again. One feature that really excites me is reciprocating cylinder steam. Yeah, I know I have cylinder steam before on the Pennsylvania J1 and Milwaukee Road S3, but that's different. It sprayed steam out of all four holes at once. Don't get me wrong, that feature is really cool, but that's not how real steam engines do it. On a real steam engine, they spray steam out of two holes out of the four at once. And it switches holes once the train moves. And it sure looks better now that they got the feature right. To load smoke fluid for cylinder steam straight down the stack. Same hole as the stack smoke. 
This time it's a rare 30 drops. I checked the manual. It's usually 20. This is the first Vision Line engine where the switches are not under the sand dome. It's a streamlined engine. Who knows where the switches are under? And it's the first Vision Line steamer that doesn't have a whistle steam. The 4449 or the GS5s, that's the one. Instead, Dynamo. The steam turbine powered electrical generator that powers every light you see on the engine. And there's three. Okay, I checked the manual for this and it confused me. The smoke fill hole on the manual is at the wrong spot. I mean, seriously, the wrong hole could cause mechanical problems. Why did Lionel make the manual like this? Now I don't know which hole to fill it with. That's like having a bomb with two wires. One blows it up and the one disarms it. But trust me, it's this hole. And since I picked the GS4, I got in an extra feature. This blinking Mars light. You can turn that off by holding down AUX2, then press this button for on and this button for off. Now, if anybody's wondering why did I pick 4449 when I already have a Rail King version, well, I actually decided to sell the Rail King version and this and buy this to save money. Yeah. Now let's run this train!
And that was... Mother f***ing Vision Line.